Welcome to Maintenance Matters. I'm Michael. And I'm Sarah. And hey, how about a pop quiz? You see all these letters and numbers? Do you know what they mean? Well, let's start at the beginning. That's always a good place. So the P stands for passenger. That's a standard load-bearing tire. Next, there's a number, the 235. That's the tire's width in millimeters. So 235 millimeters, or about 10 inches. Then the aspect ratio. It's a number that expresses the height of the sidewall as a percentage of the tread width. The what of the what? It's really quite simple. So if the sidewall height is half the width of the tread, then it would be a 50 series tire. Oh, so the higher the series, the taller the sidewall. Exactly. So next up we have the R, which stands for radial, and the 16 is the wheel diameter in inches. Three more to go. This is the tread wear rating. The higher the number, the longer the tire should wear. And traction and temperature ratings, graded A, B, and C, with A being the best. For maximum tire safety, it's super important that you never exceed the maximum tire pressure or load rating. So for this tire, it's 8,000 pounds or 2,000 pounds per tire. Now that sounds like a lot, but it can add up quickly if you think about it. We've thrown a lot at you today, but now you have a general overview of how to read a tire sidewall. And about that pop quiz. Rest easy, because the expert service advisors and qualified technicians at any of our service centers nationwide can tell you everything you need to know. And help you pick the right tire for your car and your budget. For Maintenance Matters, I'm Michael. And I'm Sarah. Remember, when it comes to maintenance, it matters.